Greetings everyone. Meditation is an important aspect of our yoga practice. In order to receive the full benefits of meditation, we need to find a way to sit that is stable and supported without becoming rigid. In this video, I'll show you how to work the details of your sitting posture to create stability and ease in your spine, followed by a prayer that you can use either as the beginning of an asana practice or the beginning of your meditation practice. Good evening. Good evening. So would you all come to a comfortable sitting position? You may sit cross-legged or in Vajrasana like I am. I have a, slight, a small block underneath my buttocks. Otherwise, um, you can sit on a blanket. I want you to sit with your spine straight. And Mary Ellen, in the corner, you need to come forward away from the wall. And you need to bring your blankets with you. And if you need another blanket or a block under your buttocks to raise it up higher so that you can sit with a straight spine on your own power, do that. OK? Higher doesn't mean this part of your chest higher. It means this part. So when you sit, there should be ease in the hip flexor muscles. Mm -hmm. And you want to pull the flesh out from under the sits bones and sit evenly on the two sides and make this part soft. So Lisa, balance your knees. Your knees are out of balance, which means the right side of your pelvic floor is overstretching. Mm -hmm. Now you should feel even in your sitting bones, even in your knees, so that sitting evenly at your base will allow you to sit evenly through your whole spine. So from there, roll your shoulders back and down. But lift your armpit chest. Lift your armpit chest as you roll your shoulders back. Mm -hmm. And feel how the shoulder blade pins onto your back ribs. Mm -hmm. And then once you've made the big effort to make that happen, then soften your belly a little bit and bring a little softness to it. So sustain that interaction without overacting. Mm -hmm. Now soften your groins and let them drop down. But lift from the pit of the abdomen up to behind your breastbone. And then let the inner shoulder blades release down. So the sides of the neck become longer. Align the crown of your head with your pelvic floor. Mm -hmm. Close your eyes. Feel your breath. And as you're breathing in, notice if you're breathing through your right nostril or your left nostril. Notice if the breath is flowing only into your chest. Notice which part of the chest. Observe the front ribs and the back ribs. Let go of tension in your jaw and tension in your face. As you inhale now, breathe into the hips and legs equals as of your chest. So the sensation of the breath flows into the legs as freely as it flows into your chest. In the name of my teachers, in the name of all of our teachers who have passed yoga down to us that we might benefit today, we dedicate our practice. May our practice be fruitful. May we continue to grow in wisdom and understanding. May we be blessed together on our journey. Take a deep inhalation. And as you exhale, bowing the head without dropping the heart, surrendering the mind to the wisdom that lives within. And slowly lower your hands. 
Open your eyes. Raise your head up. Mm -hmm.